Some of the studies have sort of pointed to if you get a more heterogeneous group together, so a more diverse group together, the evidence seems to suggest that people work harder. And by that, I mean, they tend to know unconsciously that they're less likely to share the same worldview as all the other people in that group. And that forces the brain into a higher state of problem solving. And so a lot of the evidence, um, a phenomenal researcher out of Columbia, Catherine Phillips, who's sadly no longer with us, did a lot of this research. And she found if you put people into groups that are, are more diverse and they tend to, like, and you give them more creative tasks or you give them more challenging innovation-based tasks and you ask them to come up with a, a creative solution to a problem. Some of them were even as simple as like design a building that's never been designed before and they're not even architects, right? You find that you get more creative ideas come out of the diverse group than from the homogenous group. And, and some of that is because people don't share the same assumptions about the world. And so they go, oh, that's interesting that your idea is that I think it would play out quite differently for my community.